Most homes across the United States are decorated with some kind of holiday decor right now, whether that be Christmas lights, a tree, or even a menorah. And at some point, it is time to take everything down. And for some of that stuff, it is probably time for the trash. Well, we are taking a closer look at the recycling center in Green Bay and what they suggest you do before tossing away your holiday decor. Local 5's Katie Amrine has the story. The Christmas gifts have been unwrapped and the trees with their twinkling lights have been taken down. For those who plan to throw their holiday items out to the curb, you may want to consider where they'll go. Lights, for example, may be metallic and plastic, but the Brown County Recycling Center says not to put them in your blue bin. Lights are definitely something we do not want to see in your recycling bin. They are hazardous in their own right. They get tangled around our machinery, so we want them kept out. The Recycling Center says the most common mistake people make is thinking that wrapping paper is recyclable. Most wrapping paper is actually not recyclable. If it has plastic in it or me metallic sheen to it or metal of any kind on it, it's definitely garbage. So what about Christmas trees? Fake Christmas trees are garbage, plain and simple. If it's real, uh, there are a couple of options for donating um, real trees to farms. If you have any items that you aren't sure are recyclable, the Recycling Center has a solution. We do have a drop-off place here at our recycling facility on South Broadway in Green Bay that will take extra recycling material for hazardous waste, so light bulbs and tangler material like that. So as you begin undecking your halls, consider the proper way to dispose of your decor. In Green Bay, Katie Amrine, Local 5 News. Thank you, Katie. And if you are ever confused about recycling, the Recycling Center suggests downloading the app. It's called Better Bin, which helps you determine what is safe to recycle.